Hello everyone and welcome back to another video on the channel. Today we'll be doing another group review, kind of like the Thomasville Racers review I did on Halloween. And today we're taking a look at Wave 1 of the XRS Rocket Racers, the third in the XRS series behind the Mud Racers and the Drag Racers. Now, the Rocket Racers are my personal favorite XRS series just because of how cool I think they look and how the gimmick isn't really that big of a deal. Like with the Mud Racers, their gimmick was a suspension, and that was kind of the whole point of the series. With the Drag Racers, their gimmick was less of a gimmick, but it was still kind of... Uh, I didn't like it. The moving pistons on the engine. But these ones are nice, and they don't intrude too much. The Flames. I, I dig the Flames. Um, of course, this is just Wave 1 in the set. Wave 2 brings in Paul Conrev and Cam Spinner. And a pr possible Wave 3 that is coming out will be Ed Shrunken, as we saw at Toy Fair, George Newwin, uh, Michael Roeder, who I'm pretty excited to see, and Eric Breaker. So they'll be interesting to see if they come out. Um, but without further ado, let's get into Wave 1. Starting with Jackson Storm, the most unique out of the bunch, in my opinion. Because he's got this little thing on his side here that says, Warning, set in tank. Now, I suppose Jackson really will do anything to go above and beyond the rest of his competition if he's willing to put a set in tank on his side. But, I'm not going to criticize that. Um, On his hood, he's got the XRS logo, which has an orange X on it, which is pretty interesting. Because I think... Jackson usually has a blue X. Uh, on the other side of the hood, he's got XRS slash JS, which stands for Extreme Racing Series slash Jackson Storm, which I, I like that. It's kind of a homage to the land speed record vehicles that these guys are referencing. On his left side, he's got the number 2.0, as usual, and the contingency sponsors of Combustor, Synergy, Carbon Cyber, and the Piston Cup, even though they're not in the Piston Cup at the moment. Um... The rims, of course, are uh, way different from their normal rims. Um, just a silver disc kind of like rim. So as to not have any disturbances for airflow or anything. Um, orange lug nuts, which is interesting, and blue light your texture on the tire. Um, of course, he's got the classic Storm S on the side here. And the number 2.0 on the roof, facing this way instead of the usual this way. Um, a nice metallic blue shark fin. I like that. With the XRS logo on it. Jackson Storm above the door, as usual. However, it's orange, and it's quite a lot larger than it usually is. On his rear, he's got the number 2.0 with the blue flames sticking out. I like how Jackson has blue flames compared to the rest of everyone. And... More metallic blue bits here. I love the metallic blue. Dig it. Here's Jackson's blast wall. Of course, it's got the number 2.0, the XRS logo again. And a nice blue and black checkerboard pattern. I like that because it's the only one that has black on the checkerboard pattern. Getting into the, the next main character, it's Lightning McQueen. And he looks pretty cool. Um, Not my favorite, but he's still pretty cool looking. Um, on his hood, he's got the double lightning bolts coming down out of nowhere. It's also black, which is interesting. Um, the XRS logo, which has a red X. Um, and on the other side of the hood, he's got XRS slash LMQ. Obviously, Extreme Racing Series Lightning McQueen. He's got a nice determined expression. Well, not so much determined, more as a smiling expression. Um, he's got the same kind of rims as Jackson and the rest of them. However, he's got red lug nuts and no light your texture on the tires, interestingly enough. And on the left side is decals. There's a black trim here, which is interesting, with the lightning bolt coming down. Honestly, kind of reminding me of the Cars 1 lightning bolt, where it extends all the way to the rear. Um... The XRS logo once more, and the consistency sponsors of the Piston Cup, RPM, Revolting, and Clutch Aid. Repping those older sponsors, I like that. Um, 
He's got this black decal on his window with an arrow there. Pointing to an intake, I, intake, I suppose. Um, number 95 on his quarter panel. And XRS slash LMQ again. With uh, black fins being his theme and a black shark fin. On his rear end, he's got the number 95 right over here. He's got orange flames, and he's got Rusty's medicated bumper ointment. Still rocking that slogan, even after uh, 14 years. Now, that's commitment, McQueen. Here's his blast wall. The 95 is in a different font than it usually is in, too. So, I like that. It's in more of a Jackson Storm kind of font. His blast wall is red and white checkerboard. Moving on to the final main character, it's Cruz Ramirez, and I gotta say, she's honestly one of my personal favorites of this line. I love the metallic blue accents, and I love the uh, decal shape. Um, of course, on Cruz's hood, she's got the XRS logo with a yellow X, XRS slash CR, obviously Extreme Racing Series, Cruz Ramirez. She's got Smiling Expression 2, um... As Lightning does, and on the left side, she's got the same rims as everyone else. She has the light your text around her tires in white. Or is that yellow? That might be yellow. Yeah, that's yellow. Wow. Um, and metallic blue lug nuts, which is interesting. Uh, for the contingency sponsor, she has the usual Piston Cup, Carbon Cyber, Synergy, and Combustor. For the next gen racers, a metallic blue 51 with a white backdrop. And uh, metallic blue and white swoop. Kind of like the petty swoops in real life on the 43 car. So that's kind of interesting. The XRS logo. Once more. XRS slash CR again. Um, she's got an arrow on her window as well. However, it also has a warning text on it, which is interesting. 51 on the roof. And a nice metallic blue fin with Dynaco on it. I, I dig that metallic blue color. Just, ah, oh, one of my personal favorites. 51 on the rear with XRS slash CR once more. Orange flames shooting out of the metallic blue exhaust ports and metallic blue shark fins. Overall, personal favorite right here, Cruz Ramirez. Moving on to Barry to pedal here. Oh, wait, blast wall. Cruz's blast wall has the number 51, the XRS logo, and a yellow and white checkerboard pattern. Now moving on to Barry the Pedal. Next gen RPM racer. He's a nice metallic purplish blue. I dig it. Um, he's got the XRS logo with a metallic purple bluish X instead of the other color. Um, XRS slash BDP. Extreme Racing Series slash Barry the Pedal. He's got a determined expression, frowning, of course, because next gen racers aren't known for their smiles. Um, his light year text is orange, and he's got the same rims as everyone else with orange lug nuts. Orange theme going on, I kind of dig that. Uh, the number 64, XRS logo once more, the Piston Cup Combustor Carbon Cyber and Synergy, again, because he's an next gen racer, XRS slash BDP over there. And he, uh, does not have anything on his window text. He's got RPM on his orange shark fin. On the rear, he's got orange flames showing out of his black exhaust ports. The number 64, XRS slash BDP again, and orange fins down at the bottom. Overall, not the most exciting release, but he still looks pretty cool. Um, here's his blast wall. Which is orange and white checkerboard pattern, number 64, and XRS logo again. And moving on to the final release of Wave 1, Steve Slick LePage. And this guy, I stress that you get him in a store. Because if you buy him online, you're not sure what kind of quality you're going to get. This one still has some wrinkles in the decals. and was one of the best ones I could find. So just be aware that this guy is going to be hard to find in perfect condition. Even in the package. Anyway, talking about his decals, he's got the XRS logo with a nice metallic silver X in the logo. I really like that. XRS slash SLP for X Extreme Racing Series, Steve LePage. 
Admitting the slick, interestingly enough. Um, on the left side, he's got metallic green lug nuts. Light your texture on his tires. I believe that's uh, in light green. The number 34, the swoop design as usual. The piston cup, combustor, carbon, cyber, and synergy all across his side as usual. The XRS logo again on the side. And just overall, lots of metallic bits. His shark fin is green and light yellow, two-tone, with trunk fresh on it. Um, on the rear end, he's got orange flames shooting out of the black exhaust ports. Number 34 and XRS slash SLP once more. Now, he doesn't have anything on his windows either. That about does it for the die cast. However, let's take a look at his blast wall. 34, XRS, and a green and white checkerboard pattern. And that is about it on wave one of the Rocket Racers. Once I get the other two, I'll do a review on them. But for now, these are all the Rocket Racers. And I will see you all in the next video. Bye now.